Hello and welcome to a crafty episode of Go Fraser Valley. Now, when it comes to dishes, I have to admit that all mine are pretty uninteresting. In fact, I go as far to say that they're quite ugly. So I thought it'd be a good idea to visit Color Me Mine and color me some ceramics. that experienced in the art of painting ceramics. So to help me through the process, I have Crystal McCarg. Where do we start? Um, well, most people come in and the first thing they do is they pick out what they want to do. Okay. And all of our prices are listed at the bottom. And, but today... Yes, it is service day. So if you bring in two cans of food per painter, your studio fee is free. And all of our service day goods go to the Salvation Army. And we do that the last Friday of every month and we're open till 10 on Fridays. So this is our design center. Um, design this is, center? Yes. So this is where we oh. keep all of our glazes. And then we have some techniques up here that show you and give you some ideas of what you can do. And if you see something that you like, I can definitely show you how to do it. So I was thinking of designing Mario, like the Mario world. Okay, perfect. So we have a computer that's accessible to all of our customers and okay. you can basically search anything on the internet and we turn it into basically a transfer. So we really? use- What? Yeah. You're kidding. We use NCR paper, which we get at Minuteman Press and you basically just search the image you want. We size it to the size you need and then you trace it on and then you color it in like a coloring book. So how long have you been working here and doing this? I have been here since the beginning. I was here when we opened, so this is my fourth year. Oh wow, and what do you love about it? Um, I actually really like that it's that it is creative. I wanted to be a teacher at first and then decided not to become one. So I do feel like I get that chance to teach people things while I'm here. And um, I don't know, I like every once in a while when you get an idea or you see something that someone else has done and you want to try and do it, it's fun to just kind of play. Mm -hmm. And it is very therapeutic and relaxing too. So that's nice. It is, why, why is it so therapeutic? I don't know, I don't know if it's because your mind is somewhere else, because you might find this as you're doing it. You have to really concentrate on what you're doing, and so you can't really think of other things. And I find even if I am thinking of other things, it, the piece doesn't turn out the way that I hope it will. So I can't think about work right now? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> okay, well I'll just be quiet. Uh, <laughs> this will be much better. Alright, I'm curious, what are you guys making? If you want me having a seat here. <laughs> I am making a plate. Um, it's a special plate. When you have a friend that has had surgery or trouble, you make a pl this plate and you put baking on it, and underneath is a poem. And when they read the poem when it's done, they have to it's um, they have to fill it up again with baking and pass it on to another friend or family member. That's really cool. And what are you making? I'm making a cup for my friend, and then I'm gonna give it to her. Let's see. Let's show show the camera what you've made. It's like a flower on there. With both our names and then BFF. What kind of designs do you run into? We've seen a lot of stuff. My Little Pony is the biggest thing right now with girls. Really? <laughs> yes, they all want to make the unicorns or horses into My Little Pony. Boys, I'd say, is it Minecraft? That little square thing? Okay, yeah, thing? practically what I'm doing. Yes, I'd say that's probably the most popular for boys. What about adults? Adults, um, most adults like to do a mug because then they can use it and they like to see what we've done with the designs, like the tiles I showed you before, or if they see something in the studio, they definitely want to know how can I do that. So they're more adventurous as far as trying the techniques. The kids just more like to slap the paint on and, and be done, kind of. I'm done. Teacher, I'm done. 
so when will this be ready? Oh. does it for this week's episode of Go Fraser Valley. Now I'd like to remind you that if you want to figure out all the cool things that are going on in town, you can check out our social media accounts. And if you want to make sure we don't miss anything, feel free to give us an email at go underscore Fraser Valley at shaw.ca. Now as for me, I think I want a cup of tea. Well, I should probably wash this first, shouldn't I? Thanks. <laughs>